Bangladeshi plane with 71 on board crashes in Nepal. A Bangladeshi aircraft has crashed while trying to land at Kathmandu Airport in Nepal, killing at least 50 people, officials say. The U.S. Bangla Airlines plane made an unexpected turn while landing at around 2.18 p.m. local time on Monday, clipping a fence and bursting into flames, according to the airport's general manager, Raj Kumar Chetri. It came off the runway and fell down a slope, sliding for about 300 meters before it stopped on a football field, leaving a trail of twisted metal, paper and luggage along the burnt grass. There were 71 passengers aboard including four crew, 33 Nepali nationals, 32 from Bangladesh and one each from China and the Maldives. We have recovered 50 dead bodies so far, Army spokesman Gokul Bandari told Reuters. Several people had been rescued from the wreckage of the Bombardier Q-400 series aircraft, but nine were still unaccounted for, he added. Thick plumes of dark smoke rose above the Tribuvan International Airport as firefighters battled to extinguish the wreckage. At least 24 badly burned bodies, some covered with cloth and others in partially sealed body bags, could be seen beside the charred frame of the plane. All of a sudden the plane shook violently and there was a loud bang, one of the survivors, Bissinabora, told the Kathmandu Post. I was seated near a window and was able to break out of the window. Chetri said the pilot had received permission to land from a southern direction but then requested to approach from the north instead. He had reassured air traffic controllers there was no problem but did not reply after he was warned his alignment was incorrect, the airport official added. The plane should have come from the right direction, Chetri told Reuters. An official from the Civil Aviation Authority of Nepal said it was unclear why the pilot had sought to change directions. We are yet to ascertain the reason behind the unusual landing, Sanjeev Gautam told the Kathmandu Post. Amanda Summers, an American who works in Nepal, watched the crash happen from the terrace of her home office, not far from the airport. It was flying so low I thought it was going to run into the mountains, she told AP. She said it was unclear if it had reached the runway when it landed. All of a sudden there was a blast and then another blast, she said. The Nepali Prime Minister, KP Sharma Oli, tweeted that he was extremely shocked by the incident. The same aircraft reportedly skidded from a runway at Bangladesh's Sapur Airport in September 2015 while carrying 74 passengers. The aircraft sustained minor damage but no passengers or crew members were reported injured. A U.S. Bangla aircraft was forced to make an emergency landing in Dhaka last week after its pilot noticed a problem with the plane's propeller. It is unclear if it was the same aircraft involved in Monday's crash. Nepal has suffered a number of air disasters in recent years, dealing a blow to its tourist industry. Its poor air safety record has been blamed largely on inadequate maintenance, inexperienced pilots and substandard management. In early 2016, a twin otter turboprop aircraft hit a mountain site in Nepal, killing all 23 people on board. Two days later, two pilots were killed when a small passenger plane crash-landed in the country's hilly Midwest.